Welcome to a summary of the AV Forums review of the Audio Technica VM95 series turntable cartridge and stereo styli, written by Ed Sally and published February 2019. The Audio Technica VM95 is a moving magnet cartridge body that supports a range of different styli. It is a replacement for the AT95, a cartridge that was in production for nearly 40 years and shifted several million examples. The VM95 is a moving magnet cartridge body. The output is in keeping with the RIAA standard for moving magnet cartridges at 4 microvolts. This means that it will work happily into any moving magnet phono input you have. The cartridge comes in two sections. The body that physically attaches to the tone arm contains the fixed coil and the pins that the tone arm cable connects to. The other section contains the cantilever which supports the stylus. This is useful because when the stylus wears out, you can simply pop a new one on and keep listening. The body can be used with no less than six different styli. These cover all of the different qualitative levels that are commonly encountered in the market and a mono option. In every other way, bar their identifying colors, the cartridges are identical, which, as well as offering the customer plenty of choice, makes for a fascinating point of comparison. The entry level VM95C at 29 pounds and the VM95E at £44 use a bonded stylus, meaning it's attached to the cantilever via an additional shank of material to keep it in place. The next rung up the stylus ladder keeps the elliptical shape but switches to a nude design where no additional materials are used to keep the stylus in place. This is represented in the VM95EN at £99. After this, the tip can further be shaped and profiled into what are called line contact designs. These are able to follow the information even more exactly, and as the grooves tighten towards the inside of the record, it is better able to follow them and avoid end of side distortion. The VM95 gives you an option of two different ones, a micro linear one, the 149 pound VM95 ML, and a Shibita one, the £179 VM95SH. The sixth stylus in the series is the £69 VM95SP for mono records, which we haven't tested here. To read our full review of the VM95, how we tested the cartridge with the five stereo styli, and our detailed results, click the link in the description or the card top right of the video. The VM95 makes a strong case for being the best affordable cartridge on the market right now. All the versions range between being near or at the top of their respective categories, but the true sweet spots are the VM95E and the VM95ML. Both of these models sit at a point where if you find a rival that is better than the 95E, it will be at a price where you're getting fairly close to the 95ML. These are the stars of the show, but the range as a whole demonstrates the ability, user friendliness and cost effectiveness to be an unquestionable best buy. Remember to click the link to read the full review and our scores. You can also read and post comments about the VM95 cartridge in our Hi-Fi forum via the link in the description or the card top right. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click the like button and subscribe for more reviews like this coming soon. This video was produced by AV Forums, Europe's largest online home entertainment technology community for televisions, home cinema, hi-fi, movies and TV shows, tech and gadgets and video gaming plus completely free classified adverts. Thanks for watching.